challenges of central banks, I think the biggest is that they ensure that the financial system is safe. And it may seem odd to start with that, but if there's another recession, they haven't got a great deal of macroeconomic ammunition in the tank. So they're going to have to ensure that institutions like yours and the other big banks and the shadow banks are safe. And then they need to get ready in the United States to withdraw their monetary stimulus steadily but surely. And there'll be volatility from time to time, but that doesn't matter very much. Central banks are leaders in their sphere. And I, I would like to see them go back to the virtues of a previous generation, the generation of the 1980s, really, in carefully explaining to the public that they can help preserve stability of the financial system and price stability, but that's it. And that th those are preconditions for prosperity, for the good things of life, but they are not going to enough to deliver the good things of life, and therefore they can't be relied upon too much. And that's quite a message for them to get across, but that's what they need to do.